one, two, three. Woo! That was a lot. <laughs> Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. There's literally a deer right behind me. I don't know if you can see it, it's just behind these trees right across the street. Just, It's just feeding, it's just finding some food right now. It's enjoying its life. Oh, well, anyways, have you ever done something in the past that you really liked but wanted to do it a little different? or maybe possibly even better. Back in July of last year, it was just one year ago, I was in South Lake Taco, Taco? South Lake Taco, a Lake of Tacos. I was in South Lake Tahoe and I took this picture. I really liked it and thought it was awesome. It was done with paint powder for those of you wondering what that color stuff is. I had some more of that stuff laying around. I brought it with me on this trip to Pennsylvania and I wanted to do something with it. So I decided why not make a photography episode using paint powder. I really enjoyed doing this one because I was able to get my sisters involved and they had a lot of fun, especially the younger one. But we all got really, really messy. Okay, today we're gonna get messy and some more photography. I got my sisters with me, um, dragged them into this. I drugged them into this, not drugged, dragged, drugged it. I don't know. I dragged my sisters into it. Um, we're gonna be messing around with paint powder today. Gonna make a mess out here. It'll wash out, don't worry. It's, it's uh, eco-friendly, the environment's gonna be fine. It's just like painted cornstarch. We're not gonna mess anything up. The environment's gonna be okay. But we had to find a place to do this. We're just gonna be throwing this around and doing different pictures with who knows what. Let's get started. Are you excited? Yes. Sure. Yeah? Yeah. Are you just gonna throw it everywhere? I don't know. You don't know what you're gonna do? No. Are you waiting for my direction? Yes. Okay, I guess I am the photographer. <laughs> First of all, we started with Melanie and she wanted to do the red paint powder, which was great because it really stood out from all the forest and against all the green. All right, first off, I'm gonna need you to open the paint powder. You wanna throw it, throw it. Oh my God, that's a lot, Brian. Brian! Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Wait, oh man. I, wait, what do I do? Please tell me. Two, three. <laughs> oh my God. Just a little note to self here, if you're throwing the paint powder up in the air above you and facing it, make sure you to close your eyes because it might get in them. Wow, look at you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is a good picture. That was pretty cool, right? Yeah! You're covered in it. <laughs> yeah! Alright, we're clapping it, right? Yeah. Well, maybe we want it a little closer. One, two, three. Woo! That was a lot. <laughs> okay, I felt really bad on this one for Nolani because, well, she chose green and, well, we're in a forest and there's a lot of green everywhere and it didn't really pop how I thought it was going to. I thought it was gonna be more of a neon kind of green and it was just gonna stand out and pop even against all the other green that's here. But it just turned out to be a hazy, whitish, greenish color and it just blended into well and it didn't make for good pictures. Two, she was just three. so excited and it didn't turn out that great. <laughs> How do you like it? Yeah. It's cool? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we keep getting this unfortunate thing that all the powder just keeps getting in their faces when we when when they're throwing it. So we're gonna try and go this way because the wind is blowing that way and have it a little lower so it's not in in their face. Ready? You're gonna do it from low, right? Mm -hmm. Ready? One, two, three. Oh. That was a little high. All right, here we go for the third one. Um, they're gonna be throwing the red and and green at each other. So it's basically gonna be Christmas over here. They're gonna get messy. Good. Here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> This time they get to try and get me dirty, where they're gonna throw it at me. I'm gonna be holding this though to protect the camera. Um, I'm probably gonna be the one getting dirty on this one. Three, two, and one. <laughs> <laughs> at least, at least the camera's safe. <laughs> it got everywhere. I hope so. Look at me. It looks good with all black. <laughs> I can say 100% that the girls had fun throwing it at me and getting a chance to get me dirty after I had them throw it at each other. 
But before we continue, look at these shots of them. Melanie's just enjoying it, and well, Nolani's just having an absolute blast. But we can't forget about me because I got it pretty bad too after I let them throw it at me. It got everywhere. Oh my god, it got everywhere. It got all over my face, my shirt, my hair. It was it was just everywhere. Okay, but let's continue. I had this one idea where I thought it'd be cool if I sat on the hood of a car and I just threw paint powder from there. Okay, I'm gonna do my shot a little differently. I'm gonna use yellow and purple powder paint and I'm gonna be right up here. I'm just gonna throw it to the side. Let's get started. Melanie, are you helping me with this one? All right, let's get this started. Okay, one, two, three. At some point in the middle of this, I realized that two, three, these were Kobe Bryant colors and I didn't really mean to do that from the beginning, but I just thought that was pretty cool. One, two, three. That hurt. Jesus. <laughs> two, three. Well, it went that way. <laughs> the wind the came win. at the not right time. <sighs> we definitely got something good on that one. All right, that's all I wanted for myself. Okay, I can say with very high levels of confidence right now that some of them turned out good, some of them turned out not so good, kind of bad, and I don't know if any of them turned out better than the first photo that I took from South Lake Tahoe a year ago but that's for you guys to let me know down in the comments below. So let's get into them. All right, the first pictures that we have are with Melanie and the red paint powder that just popped from the background. It stood out from all the green and the forest that is out here. And we just see the cloud of paint, of red paint powder that's above her. And as you keep looking through the photos, you see her almost like screaming because she didn't realize how heavily it was gonna come back down on her and maybe get in her face and her eyes a little bit. But I just thought that was pretty funny. We also had a second round with the red paint powder where she clapped it in front of her and that produced a huge cloud, a big red cloud that just also popped so well. The only thing that I didn't like about this one was that you couldn't see her face through the cloud obviously, which would have been nicer if it was a little lower and we could have seen both of those. Now Nolani's pictures, like I said already, I didn't like it too much and I felt bad because she was so excited and it didn't come out as good because as you can see, it's just a green, white, greenish haze that didn't really pop in the background. I thought it was gonna be more neon, but sadly it wasn't and it just didn't come out so well, covered her face, didn't pop that much and it just wasn't the best, they weren't the best. Sadly, another one that I didn't like so much was the one that they were throwing it at each other. I mean, it was cool, the idea, but it was my fault, the composition of the photo, the angle was just not there. I think a different angle would have made this photo look a lot, a lot better. So I'll just keep that in mind for next time, go from a different angle and, and see if I could get something better. With them throwing it at me, Noelani's face was covered from the green paint powder. Other than that, I think this one actually came out pretty well because both of them had a lot of paint powder and they both stood out at least somewhat from the, from the background. And then finally me, I did the one where I was sitting on top of the Jeep with the Kobe Bryant colors, the purple and yellow. I guess they're more of Lakers colors, but Kobe Bryant is really, really known for them. And I just threw them out to the sides and I think these looked really awesome. Both the yellow and the purple stood out from the backgrounds, didn't really clash with anything. I thought they were amazing. I thought these pictures came out, came out great. And to end it all, I still had a little bit of paint powder left. I went to the street and I was hoping for a picture where I was there throwing the paint powder and you could see to the end of the street because it was a long empty street. My mistake was I used too wide of a lens. So next time I would use a telephoto lens to get that nice compression in the background. And I think that would have made the picture look that much better. Even though it didn't come out that bad, I think it would have looked better with a telephoto and all that compression in the lens. But this is just a learning process. This is what we're doing here. We're just trying, getting creative, and seeing what works and what doesn't, and learning for the next time. Okay, that was paint powder photography. Let me know what you guys think about those photos. Are any of them better than the first one that I took in South Lake Tahoe a year ago? Let me know down below. Thank you guys for watching another video. Please consider liking this video, subscribing if you haven't already, and I'll catch you guys next time.